know that uh, he was quite a religious man. He, he was Lutheran. Mm -hmm. And uh, because I, I took him to church, you know, to the Lutheran church here in Gulfport while he was visiting it. And we had quite a few conversations about our, you know, Christianity and, and different, you know, aspects of our life and, and, and how that played into it. And I, I think his art, you can see, you know, he enjoyed so much the beauty of nature. And, and, and he talks about that, Han Tracy, in, in the, uh, the video of how that communicate, you know, with nature and, and, and it helps us, you know, to understand. And and he's he was really into the, the spiritual and preserving, you know, this beautiful aspect of earth that we've been blessed with. And so, anyway, uh, this is how we came to this point. And I thought about it and I said, this is kind of like the pieces of a puzzle. It all fell together at the right time, and I think this is the right place. I think it has the the right connection with him, and since he was with the university, you know how how more appropriate a setting could this be, and his religious aspect, and then to be able to do this to honor him and to bring this work out that has been stored since 1989 <laughs> and has not been seen. So it's it's just, um, it, I, I feel blessed to have been in the company of this individual, mm -hmm. to have gotten to know him and to, to be able to carry on now with uh, his art and to get other people to know about him and what an interesting and talented individual he was. Love about this that you know, as I as I was listening to Mary, is there so many parallels with Walter Anderson? You know, watercolor painter, intensely inspired by nature, just in you know, entranced with the natural world. And there's they they are like similar spirits. Those two. And he traveled. Uh, he and I, traveling. He, he was all over the world. You know, all over the map. And, and he talks about he was in China when he perfected some of his work. And Walter Anderson also went to China, but Walter Anderson not so much with interacting with uh -huh. people.